Yo, what's up, everybody? Salandia Hammond here, affectionately known as Sue Ham, baby. I wanted to just come and talk to y'all real briefly for about three minutes, and I'm watching the timer. I got to share this with you. On yesterday, uh, June 13th, we actually finally took our son out to celebrate his birthday. We went to um, lunch, and we went to go catch a movie. And as we were leaving the restaurant from lunch, uh, there's a gentleman that approached our vehicle. And he said, hey, uh, before he even got a chance to ask, right, uh, Maurice was like, I'm sorry, I can't help you. I don't got no, no money on me. And uh, the guy said, but I don't even want any money. I just want something to eat. Me and my fiance, we just want something to eat. Now, mind you, we're sitting outside of a restaurant. So, and Maurice put the car in reverse and we were about to leave. And I typically don't carry money on me, but I have my card. And I, for some reason, I did have money on me this particular time. And so I said, hold up, wait. Um, I got to go. I got to go. I, I got to go feed them. Uh, I don't like people to be hungry. I'm going to just be straight up honest with you. So I get out of the car and I said, sir, you just want something to eat? And he says, yes. <clears throat> and so he and his fiance followed me into the restaurant and I paid for their food. And as I was getting ready to leave, this man dug in his pocket and he pulled out a fistful of coins and he was trying to give it to me to help offset some of the costs I paid for him to eat. And I said, sir, I don't need it. I said, I do appreciate you wanting to pay me. I said, but I feel honored and I'm blessed that I'm able to do this for you. You and your fiance have a great day. When you get up on your feet, bless the next, the next person. Okay, so we leave. We continue to have a great day celebrating Jackson's birthday, even though his birthday was on the 11th. We're celebrating it two days later. That's because we were running uh, with the campaign from Miss Tiffany Cooks. Anywho, we leave. Okay, so today I'm taking Jackson to, uh, to you know, up towards Columbia area, and I get this inbox on social media on my fan page, Sue Ham, the fan page, and it says, hey, we would like to feature you in our magazine, uh, you know? And I'm like, wait a minute, who are you? Wait a minute, uh, uh, wait a minute. And I'm like, wait a minute, who are you? How did you find me? And how much is this gonna cost me? And um, they were like, no, it's not gonna cost you anything. We wanna feature you in the magazine. And uh, I was like, wow. Now I don't do things to get a blessing back. I do expect God to bless me. I do. I have expectations. Okay. I'm just going to put it out there. But when I give, I don't do it expecting, Oh, you owe me something or I'm going to get this and da, 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 da. Um, and I had completely forgotten about the gesture on yesterday with the gentleman and his fiance. But as soon as I got that inbox and I read it and I didn't assume that they wanted to feature me in the magazine for free, I simply asked them, what is the cost? He said, no, it's for free instantaneously the thought came back to me about the gentleman and his fiance needing food to eat and me getting up, not having a second thought and uh, paying for their meal, which by the way, was at a, a freaking um, buffet place. It cost me 18 bucks and I left a tip. So it cost a little bit more. Uh, but here it is, not even 24 hours later, and I'm being blessed with an opportunity to be featured in a magazine. And one of my things that I write down in my journal and that I say is that I want to inspire and impact and influence more and more people, people I don't even know. And so for this video to come in, it just constantly shows me that good deeds are rewarded. And I say that all the time. When you have the ability to bless people, bless them. You don't always have to broadcast it. Some people say, I don't broadcast everything I do. I don't broadcast everything I do either. But there are a lot of things I do broadcast because I feel like people need to hear it. And when they hear it and they experience it, then they can go out and the efforts can be doubled because then they start doing it. And then somebody else gets inspired to do it. And then before long, we will erase hunger. We will inspire people to follow their dreams. We will inspire people to take action in spite of fear. So I said that to say this, good deeds do not go unrecognized. You will get rewarded. It may not be from the person that you blessed. It may not be 24 hours later. It may not be a year later, but I do believe that you will be blessed. So I want to say this, and I'm going to close this broadcast. I asked the gentleman, I said, how did you find me? Because, you know, I do the marketing thing. So I got to know, you know, how people find me. And he said, I do a lot of social media research 
and your profile came up and you look very interesting. Come on, somebody. Now, I'm not asking you to buy into what I'm saying or try to persuade you into believing that you should give. All I'm saying, all I'm doing is sharing my experience with you, telling you what I believe. And what I believe is that when you do good, when you put good into the world, it will come back to you. Come on, somebody. Come on. I love y'all. My name is Salandia Ham and I'm with SueHam.com. You know, I'm always encouraging you to live, love, learn, and laugh, to not quit, to follow your dreams to success. Mm-hmm. Peace. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Share the video. People need to be inspired. Share the video.